Hello everyone, SB Architects here. Today I want to show you how to turn your colorful floor plans into black white floor plans in ArchiCAD. Sometimes you may want to turn your floor plans into black white floor plans because they seem simpler and more professional. And also they are printed out friendly. There are three different ways of doing that. You can just change your print settings. You can change your print settings to black white or gray scale. But if you want to save that as PDF file, it may cause some trouble because the person who gets your project wants your project black white. They can think that changing print settings might be difficult. Therefore, in order to export, two options will left. One of them is changing your graphical override settings and other option is changing your output layout settings. Let's start from beginning let's go to file menu and go to save as and from the bottom of the window i'm going to make this pdf you will change page options maybe a4 it depends your project and we will see this document options here you can see the save pdf bit color black white and gray scale after that i'm gonna use this current zoom and click bit to page and i'm gonna click ok and save and we will get this it's black white or gray scale you can send this someone else they can print it out or use this as a template for their project but your project is still colorful let's go back to archicad and you will see that this is colorful again and if you don't want to continue working like this you will change something i will show you the second method i will go to the layout book and you will see some layout settings as you can see we are in the ground floor let's delete this and I will show you how you can place your floor plan into this ground floor layout. We will double click this ground floor and we will go to project map and we will just drag and drop from here to here. That's it. You can change these settings. You can crop this. You can change the other settings such as this ground floor text. This is a title. And to change the visibility from the colorful to black white, we will use this color and transparency settings. It's defined by pen set. We will click this gray scale. Now it's same as we printed it out. And this is black and white. This is another option. If we go back to ground floor, our project is still colorful. And now I'm going to show you how to change your colorful project to black white completely. And you can go back to your default setup with one click. We will use the graphical override settings. We will click this and you will see some predetermined settings. In order to create one, you will click this combination and you will click this new and i'm gonna call this black and white after that we will call and create some rule to turn this out into a black white image let's go to manage rule or click here and click add and click manage rules this is rule one Let's use this as this name and now we can see the value criteria and other settings. First of all, let's presume that we are going to change all of the lines, objects, windows, doors, everything, all types. We will use this all types. If you want to change something else, you will click one of these door, window, stair, etc, etc. We will uncheck all of these. 
except this line type. This is now 141. It's black. We can turn this out into orange, purple, or other color. Let's use this 141. And click OK. Under the black part, we will see this order of rules to be applied, ruler 1. You can remove this or add once again. It's always there. Let's click OK. And now, as you can see, it's completely black white except zone. Why the zones are colorful? Let's fix that too. And we will create another rule. Let's click this new. And we're gonna call this new rule. It's okay. This time I'm going to choose zone. And as you can see, this is not a line. This is some kind of field type. Therefore, we are going to change field type from here. If I click this field type, the field type of the zones will turn into common brick. We are not gonna do that. Instead of that, we will click this background pen and fill foreground pen. If you use background pen for your zone, you will click this background. If you only use foreground, you will use your fill foreground pen. Let's try this only fill foreground pen and let's make this one or some grayscale. Something like this. And you will see that override cut fill foreground. This is cut fill and this is not a cut. Therefore, this won't be applied into your floor plan. Therefore, we are going to click something different, such as this override color fill foregrounds or override drafting fill foreground. Let's select them all to get this guarantee. Let's click OK. After that, we are going to use our new rule under this black byte. Let's click this plus and double click this new rule. Click OK. As you can see, it's working now. Let's go back to the settings. And I will show you it's going to work only clicking, activating this one. Because this is some kind of cover field foreground. Let's try reverse. It didn't work because it's not a simple field. Anyway, let's go back to the settings. And click the previous settings. And let's say that I want to use only red color for objects. All other elements will be black, white or gray. Only objects will be red. To do it, we will do something different. We will click a new rule and maybe we will call this object. And for these settings, we will change this to object from here and the line pan will be red. We can click OK and we can call that rule and we can see that. Let's click this. This is object. Let's go back to settings. Let's go to object. These settings are OK, but our order is not OK. First of all, the object rule will be applied after that new rule will be applied. And finally, rule 1 will, will be applied. This was changing. This was about changing all of the types into black white. So we will only see this. Therefore, we have this changing rule tools. With this changing order tools, we can move this rule down to the bottom 
of the list. First, this rule one will be applied, and finally, this object will be applied. You will see that just like this. And this was how you can change your floor plans into black white floor plans and how you can specialize this. And if you are serious about learning ARCAD, you can go to my Patreon page. From there, I will be waiting for you. Alright, thank you for watching. Until next time, have a nice day. Bye.